Brothers and sisters, a very, very good morning to you once again. And it's me, Hillary, talking to you, telling you about sin. Jesus loves you, brothers and sisters, and Jesus wants you to get rid of your sin completely. There was this story of this woman caught in adultery in John chapter 8. This woman was supposed to be sentenced to death, was supposed to be stoned to death, like you and me, who deserved hell, who deserves death for our sin. But Jesus comes there, appears on the sin. As Jesus appears on the sin, people ask him, this woman is caught in adultery. The law says this, what do you say? And Jesus talks something contrary to the law. The law demanded to be killed, but his grace demanded salvation. The law demanded death for this woman, but Jesus' love and Jesus' grace demanded forgiveness, healing, and setting free. And Jesus says to all those people who were accusing her, he that is without sin, cast the first stone. Friends, you and I who are so evil, we're always talking bad about others. We're always talking so much about others as though we have no sin in our lives. We are casting those stones on our own brothers and sisters so often. So God is talking to you and me today and saying, if you are without sin, you cast that stone now. And everybody from that crowd dropped their stones and went away. So I hope you too will stop that mouth of yours from today onwards and never accuse any brother and sister of yours and cast that stone on them because we are all sinners, brothers and sisters. Accept the people the way they are in your life and give them the love of Jesus that is needed to overcome that sin. Jesus gave that love to that woman and that woman overcame sin. And I hope you and I, we will all overcome sin with the love of Jesus. God bless you, my beloved brothers and sisters. We love you. Have a wonderful day. Amen. I'm coming back to the heart of worship And it's all about you It's all about you, Jesus I'm sorry, Lord, for the thing I made When it's all about you It's all about you